Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I have a makeup tutorial that I would like to share with you guys. Today I'm just going to do a spring eye makeup look with a lot of colourful shades and the palette I'm just going to use today is from NARS Cosmetics. So I'm just going to use this limited edition eyeshadow palette. So its name is Danger Control. They are opaque and shimmery shades so um, I do believe that with these shades they are very unique in the formula and it's very hard to find these shades on the market out there so um, with this palette I'm very excited to create the makeup look so to start off I'm just gonna prep my eyes using Drunk Elephant Shaba Complex Eye Serum so this is a copper peptide formula it's got a very silky formula that help with anti-aging and also if you have dark circle it's also help to brighten the areas literally just need one pump then i'm just gonna apply it with my fingers so i'm massaging already eyes so the next step i'm just gonna use the mineral infused face primer so this is from elf cosmetics so it's got like a jelly formula and it's clear and again I'm just going to apply it to the four areas of my face and then blend it out. So now for foundation I'm just going to use uh, these two from Too Faced so they are Peach Perfect Comfort Matte Foundation. So I'm just going to use a brighter shade which is Almond and a darker shade which is Honey so I'm just going to do brightening and contouring at the same time. I literally concentrate on the center of my face to brighten. And then with the darker shade, I'm just kind of contours around the cheeks area. Also to the side of my forehead, along the side of my nose, and then the jawline. So now I'm just going to blend out the brighter shades first using the Damn Beauty Blender. And then I blend out the darker shade. I'm going to mix the two shades together and apply it to the neck areas. So now I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows using Benefit Cow Brow Gel Brow um, Color. So this is in the shade number six. So it's come with a tiny brush. It's like a grayish black. Now I'm just going to open the palette and using the first shades for my transition. So pretty much all I see here, all the shades here are shimmery. So I'm just going to go in with a light shade for my transitions. And I'm just going to use this Echo Tool Device Crease Brush. I'm just going to pack the shades into my crease. And it's also amazing that you can create a pastel look with this eyeshadow palette. So I'm just going to use our Eva Lux Crease Brush. I'm just going to pick up the shade right here. And that's going to go to the outer V. So I'm so now I'm just going to go in with the shade right here, which is a bright pink shade. I'm just going to apply it to the center of my lid. Then I blend it into the outer V. So I really love these shades. They blend in so well. So with Urban Decay Naked Cherry Brush, I'm just going to pick up the lighted shades in the palette. So this is like a white silver shade. And that's going to go to my inner corner. So I wrap it around my tear duct. So with the other end of the brush, I'm just going to go back to this purple shade. I'm just going to line my lower lash line with this shade. 
so now using a contour blowing brush i'm just going to pick up the shoe right here and i'm just gonna apply it to my brow bone it's had like a little bit like a purple tint to it so you can see how it coordinates really well with the outer v shade so now i'm just gonna apply some of the false lashes i'm just gonna use the ardell 402 lashes so you can see that uh, these are cluster lashes For contouring, I'm just going to apply this uh, Tarte Amazonian Clay Bronzer in Hotel Eris. And I'm just going to pair that with Bobbi Brow's Angle Face Brush. So this is a travel size. So pretty much I want to contour the hollow of my cheekbone, the size of my forehead. I know that I did a little bit contouring early on. Um, but this one just to set the makeup as well. So I'm just going to conceal my under eyes area with this concealer by Urban Decay Skin Naked Concealer in the shade Fair Neutral. And I'm just going to blend it out using the Damn Beauty Blender. gonna set under my eyes with some powder so this is a terribly um, deceless compact in fresh tone nude looks something like this I'm just gonna use elf small taper brush and I'm set on a t-zone as well so for the blush I'm just gonna use Tarte big blush book three and I'm just gonna go in with this shade right here it's called Peachy. This brush I'm using is just an unbranded taper highlighter brush. So pretty much I'm applied to the apple of my cheek. These eyeshadows come in a pan size of an eyeshadow, but the great thing is that you can use this shade as a highlighter. You know, they got the shimmery effect that really brighten up and beside that they got a lot of cool brighter tone in this palette you can use some of them as a highlighter so i'm just going to use the echo tool highlighting brush so it's a fan brush and i'm just going to pick up this shade right here um, so this is rave i'm just going to apply it to the high point of my cheek you can see how beautiful it's illuminate the high point of my cheeks and the same thing, I'm just going to go over the bridge of my nose. A little bit onto the center of my forehead. My cues bit blow. And the tip of my chin. Now I'm just going to go back to the beauty blender and I'm just going to dab off the excess. That can unify all the colors I have on my face. Now for the lips, I'm just going to use this uh, lip gloss by Bare Minerals and this is in the shade Forbidden. So that's a really beautiful opaque lip gloss. Now this is the end of my tutorial. I hope that you enjoyed this makeup tutorial. So you can follow my channel by subscribing to my channel to see more videos from me. Overall, I do really like this palette. I think it's very unique. It is something that's very hard to find out there. Besides, it's a limited edition uh, piece, so um, it may not be available in your country anymore. But overall, I do really like them. You can use them as an eyeshadow or a highlighter so it's all totally up to you because they really have this unique opaque formula beside that all the shades are very shimmery um, as I apply on to my eyes I see um, I don't see any fallout but as you can see that it's quite dusty inside the pan at the moment so it's have a very beautiful formula when it's go on to the eyes and if you want to look for something brighter shade something with pastel shade and you know with very unique shimmery formula i think this palette for you is not an ordinary palette it's not something that you can create uh, with everyday makeup look so you probably would want to create this makeup look for a festival or any special occasions that you want to feel a little bit pops on your eyes i think that's the perfect 
palette for this occasion so this is the end of my tutorial i hope you all have a wonderful day and i see you next time bye